Hey, Katie. Hey, good morning. Good morning. How's it going? Good, good. I'm here for 37 questions. You ready? Awesome. Welcome to my porch. Absolutely. What's the first thing you did in the morning? Hit the alarm. What's the second thing you do in the morning? Hit it twice. No, just kidding. I do, I do, but then I get up and make some tea. Awesome. What's your favorite sport? Softball. Did you ever play? I did. I actually played uh, two years in college. I was a pitcher. Wow, amazing. Now, what do you do in your free time? Oh, I just like to hang out and relax. Yeah, can't blame me there. What's one piece of advice you would give to younger generations? Um, to younger generations, I would actually tell them to start saving their money and buy a house, stop renting. Nice, and what advice would you give to someone wanting to buy a home? Um, to buy something that could possibly uh, help you, you know, it's a starter home and then it's gonna take you to another level. So buy in a smart area, up and coming areas. Gotcha. When did you buy your first home? I was 26. Wow. Why did you become a real estate agent in the first place? Um, you know, I guess it was kind of somewhere in me, but it was an opportunity in life that just happened. And when timing meets opportunity, that's when great things happen. I hear you. What's your favorite thing about your job? Um, I love working with people. Yeah? So, yep. What's your least favorite thing about your job? Ooh, having to make a, a bad phone call. Maybe that, um, unfortunately found termites or something happened. I hate those calls. <laughs> oh no. If you could be anywhere in the world, where would you go? I would go to Australia. Beach home or house on the lake? House on the lake. Coastal or modern? Uh, coastal all the way. <laughs> White cabinets or dark wood cabinets? Dark wood. I'm a huge wood lover. I love wood. <laughs> I can see by these shutters. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> all right, tin roof or shingles? Tin roof, um, although there are definitely different types of metal too, so. Oh, interesting. What's your favorite thing about living on the Mississippi Gulf Coast? Driving along our unobstructed beaches where you can just actually see the water. Sometimes you see the dolphins playing and it's just, it's just peaceful, peaceful and serene. I agree. What's your favorite place to eat on the Mississippi Gulf Coast? Well, I uh, kind of am biased to Hancock County, but um, when I just grab a quick bite to eat, I actually just love to pop into bodegas. You always know what you're getting, and it's just it's just comfortable and relaxing. Yeah, I love that place. So, Katie, is it true you like to thrift things and repurpose them? Absolutely. I'm a huge thrifter and junker. As a matter of fact, this, um, this fireplace actually came from the side of the road, so I do stop and pick up things on the side of the road. Uh, these chairs came from a yard sale. And, um, and I, this is actually one of my latest projects. So I actually got this from a local, um, from a local uh, uh, junk shop. So and I'm getting ready to paint it. Do you mind if I start painting now? Nope, go okay. right ahead. Oh, awesome. <laughs> one last sip. <laughs> Katie, what's your most embarrassing memory? Uh, well, you know, you can have a few in life, but I guess one of my first ones was when I actually took, um, I took my broker to one of my first listing appointments. We're walking through the yard and I was so proud. You know, it was my first little thing. It was actually on uh, Baltic Avenue. Um, so I always talked about me. I feel like I'm a monopoly board. But, um, but anyhow, I'm walking through the yard. All of a sudden I step in a hole, trip, fall. She says I did the most graceful roll and just pop back up while she's still kind of looking around. She's like, what happened to you? I, was, <laughs> I just dropped and rolled. <laughs> well, nice save, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have any regrets? Um... One regret that I have is actually, uh, I used to work for the casino and uh, worked with some Navy SEALs and one day they wanted me to jump out of a plane with them and I didn't do it, although I have really no other desire to jump out of a plane, but why not jump out with those people? Um, other than that, I don't live my life with any regrets. Wow, well, I'll have to keep that in mind. Someone asked me to jump out of a plane, take it. Absolutely, <laughs> yep. <laughs> I don't know why, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's the first job you ever had? Um, besides babysitting, I actually, my first official job was at Pete's Sports Bar in Lafayette, Louisiana. And what did you want to be when you wanted to, when you were a little girl and wanted to grow up? What did you want to be? Um, I actually wanted to be an undercover DEA in high school. <laughs> wow. Quite a change from what I do now. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, if you could give your younger self any advice, what would you say? Don't eat candy. I love candy. Just don't start. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite holiday? I love Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras, actually, well, it's not quite purple, but it's a blue, but I love Mardi Gras. <laughs> what's your second favorite holiday? Thanksgiving. You just, you know, for both of them, you're just with your family. Like I treat Mardi Gras, it's my family comes together out on the street. And what's your favorite holiday tradition? 
Um, we actually, uh, I love for everybody to gift, get a gift. And of course, as we're all um, an older family, so we started a tradition about five or six years ago. Of we would go to the um, Dollar Tree or whatever, just $3 and under gifts. Even if you find something like amazing on clearance or something like that. And you, um, we do a whole just big Christmas swap, but it's so much fun because it can be silly stuff. It can be fun stuff. It can be useful stuff. It's just, it's a fun time. But the sillier the gifts, the better and the more fun we have with it. So just a lot of laughs. Yeah, that sounds amazing. What's your favorite movie? I fall asleep during movies, most movies. So any movie is good, I think, up until the point that I fall asleep. So I like, I like all of them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't watch much TV. <laughs> Well, what's your favorite book then? Um, well, as far as books go, I, people don't know this about me, but I read anything. Oh, looks like we have the trash man actually coming along. So, um, But I read a little bit of everything. And so a couple of the books that I'm reading right now, I know this is extremely diverse, but, um, but I have A Day No Pigs Would Die because my daughter had to read this for school. And so she said it was a great book, so why not? And then um, You Deserve a Drink, which is probably what I deserve quite often, I think. So this one's a little little raw, but it's cool. <laughs> yeah, uh, nice selection there. All right, if you won the lottery tomorrow, what's the first thing you would do? So before my husband and I got married, um, I got a ticket and um, it was it was a $150 ticket and I only had like 40 bucks to pay it because I had a lot of bills and um, and owned a house and a car and everything. So I was kind of doing my own thing. But uh, but anyhow, I borrowed money from him. And um, so now we have a joint account. So I feel like I could never pay him back. But if I won the lottery, it would be my money. And so I'd pay him back first. And then I would put it in our joint account so we could share. But <laughs> I mean, yeah, got to pay off your you debts. You got to pay off your debts. That's right. <laughs> well, sunsets or sunrises? Sunsets for sure. Yes, I agree. Morning person or night owl? Night owl, hence sunsets. Yep. <laughs> and Good morning. What... <laughs> Little projects going on all the time. <laughs> Sorry, my neighbors and clients actually. Wow, you're so popular. I just sold their house, I know, it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, what brings you happiness? Um, you know what, just doing projects that I wanna do. You know, cause I, because I like to junk and thrift, I tend to collect a lot of projects. And so sometimes I just wanna do what I wanna do. Like this, this was actually a birthday gift from September. I'm gonna get around to it now. So, <laughs> inspiring. Yeah, well, what, uh, what do you like to do to unlock, unwind and relax? Um, I mean, I really just like to hang out, hang out with my family. We actually love a fire. So having the, having the uh, free find fire pit on the side of the road really came in handy. <laughs> <laughs> if you could have one superpower, what would it be? Oh, just one. Um, oh, because it'd be a toss up between telekinesis and flying. I could get a lot done faster if I could fly and, uh, and I could see a lot more people and that would be a lot more fun for me. Um, but telekinesis, everything could just come to me and that'd be cool. So, I don't know, toss up. All right, well, what's one thing that you've learned? One thing I'm, that I've learned is um, I'm not always right. Oh, touche. <laughs> <laughs> Katie, with you know Thanksgiving being your favorite holiday or one of your favorite holidays, tell me, what are you thankful for? Um, I'm thankful for life, you know? I mean, life is absolutely worth living and I'm thankful for all the things and the people in my life. And um, every day I just wake up and count my blessings. I don't need a lot. I'm really pretty simple, um, so I'm just thankful that I have the opportunity to just enjoy life and enjoy the people and the things that are around me. So I truly feel blessed all the time, so. I love that. Yep. Well, do you need a help with this? Do you need a hand? Oh, yeah, hey. Yep. hey. Absolutely, you can always use a hand on a good project, okay. so. Oh, thank you. Thank you, <laughs> yeah, absolutely, right. come on. Here's the paint. <laughs>